Hey everyone, how y'all doing? So today I got two cool little EDC pouches to look at. These are from Alpaca at alpacagear.com. My son bought these and give, he gave me a chance to check these things out. And let me tell you, Alpaca's got some, some cool pouches. Quite a few you know different designs um, these two here you know come in different colors little different materials like you know you can get get these with the velcro patch you know for little patches on the front or plain um, some of these are made out of recycled post consumer polyester fabric it says made from discarded and recycled PET bottles and looking these up on their website I think this is one of those eco ones but I'm not 100% sure there's one on there that looks just like this um, but yeah it's supposed to be 100% carbon neutral weatherproof all that stuff um, then the other one this one well we'll get into it um, Let's look at this one first. This is the hub pouch and it says on the back smart and sleek pouch perfect for small tools, torch, cards and other small items compatible with the hub keychain so separately and yeah so there's the tag. See the tags are still line but this is a nice little pouch. Um, this uh, outside dimensions real fast. It's about 4.72 inches this way, which is about 12 centimeters. It is 3.54 inches high, which is like 9 centimeters. And it says it's 0.98 inches deep, thick. So pretty small. You can see compare it to my hand um, anything else I can compare it to real fast uh, really can't think of anything but yeah nice little pouch and yeah we'll look in the inside we'll go over on the side camera and check it out get it in frame so this might be the post consumer you know recycled material but I'm not sure I think these, they're not labeled, but someplace I saw it said YKK zippers. I don't know if these are or not, but you have this little front pouch with a zipper, and that's just one, one little pocket. It's, you know, a couple inches deep maybe. Nice little zipper pocket. Definitely can fit cards credit cards and stuff in here on the inside the main compartment you have a double double zipper and that that's the inside so quite a few little little pockets in this on this side you have these two two smaller pockets Right there plus you have two elastic straps right here so you can hook something on go over the pocket or into the pocket and then behind here you have two more little pockets that go all the way to the bottom so I can fit just about my whole finger down in there um, same size the pockets are the pockets the elastic band and these pockets are the same size about half of it and on this side you have one one whole pocket here also you have three elastic bands in here and another full size larger pocket here um, very nice 
alpaca tag right there on the back it does say made in China so these are made in China and I didn't say the price of this one but this one is about 35 bucks different different color or different materials and stuff you know there's a price range it could be a little more a little less but I what I found it looks exactly like this is listed at 85 bucks yeah this is a nice little nice little pouch you could fit quite a few things in here you can definitely let's go over here you can fit a little pen an elastic loop right there you can fit a Leatherman squirt in one of these pockets that fits pretty good um, a little tiny crescent wrench uh, let's put this put that over there you know so that's like a four inch crescent wrench pry tool um, you definitely they'll fit in something um, do 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 let me let me get my knife out um, today I happen to be carrying the Kaiser Latvin Mini this is a oh closed three three and seven eighths about almost four inch knife and no oh, let's put it over here in this back pocket let's try that one so you know a nice small folding knife to fit in there also so yeah these are pretty this one's pretty nice I like the organization capabilities of it with the different pockets and elastic bands and stuff um, very nice got a little tag up here a little loop you could hook a carabiner through it but yeah um, this one was the hub pouch and yeah you could fit a lot of stuff it's it's fairly small um, you could sh definitely I could shove this in my back pocket I could probably this probably shove in my front pocket it's going to be all I have in my pocket but that's pocketable um, nice nice to, nice organization in that one <clears throat> um, move these out of the way now this one is the zip pouch pretty basic um, I found this on the website it said has ripstop nylon lining RFID blocking materials in this one this has water this does have YKK zippers waterproof YKK aqua guard zippers and you can see they kind of cover themselves up so that's nice both zippers are that way um, waterproof water resistant I hate saying waterproof because something water would get into almost anything um, <clears throat> this one is 5.12 inches long or about 130 millimeters and about 3 and 3.34 inches tall and this has basically two zipper pockets again front one just a slip pocket and yeah see the you can see the rip stop nylon lining um, bring it back over here in just a second and on the top is a zipper and inside it's one pocket but it's got a divider in it so you could definitely put your cards and money and everything in here um, the tag on the back again says smart and sleek pouch perfect for credit cards cash or other small items and again it's compatible with the hub keychain sold separately so yeah bring it over to this camera get a little closer look I, I do like the orange and I, 
they both had this um, diamond pattern. I don't know exactly what that is. It almost feels like it's got um, threading in there. But yeah, basically you got one zipper on this one. And try to get a good look on the inside. Got gray backing on this side, and then you can see, you can almost see through the orange part. Nice little pocket. And get a closer look at the zipper, how they're, they're, they seal up. So, pull that back. Then, the inside here is gray with that little divider inside so you got two two separate compartments um, very nice again you got this little tag a little loop here you can hook a carabiner or something through it here's the label or the tag the zip pouch and yeah this is about I've seen the zip pouches different colors different materials from 25 to 35 I believe this is about 35 bucks also but very nice very nice they're almost the same size with the rounded corners here it's a little bit smaller a little bit thicker this is very very thin so yeah this this would definitely work for this would work for a wallet for sure because you can put your like main ID, driver's license, whatever, your debit card, something you use all the time right here in the front. Um, then in the back, you can put other cards, you can put cash, um, <clears throat> anything you want, some band-aids. I mean, you don't have to use this as for credit cards or anything. It could be used for a little first aid kit. A little tool pouch I mean you could just load this thing right up um, what was I gonna I was gonna say something about this front pouch or pocket again but can't remember what I was gonna say but very you know versatile little pouch very well made these are you know extremely well made the stitching looks great on both of them um, they seem very, very durable. I like, I like this hub pouch, the, the different pockets in there. Nice little pouch with a lot of organization. But yeah, I guess that would do it. Um, I really just wanted to show these. The, again, these are alpaca. And on a tag it says www.alpacagear.com. They're on Instagram at Alpaca Gear. I believe I do follow them on Instagram. I have for a long time. I haven't bought anything myself from them, but they have so many, so many different things. There's one little sling bag that I really like. I think I'm gonna I'm gonna get some time um, but yeah my son bought these and I think he's buying one of the sling bags and try to get himself organized a little bit but I guess that'll do it just wanted to show these to you um, do the usual like comment subscribe to the channel if you haven't and until the next video bye